and the pride of Eaton. Walker Martin drafted in the second round, 52nd overall to the San Francisco Giants. Martin led the nation in home runs this past season. That's just one of his many accomplishments. And Martin isn't only a great baseball player. He also quarterbacked Eaton High School to three straight state titles in football and was the 3A football player of the year this past season. But as Eric Christensen explains, it's the national pastime that has always been Walker's calling. That work. Good. Yep. Walker Martin's story begins here at this family barn. It's a place where a father taught his son to hit and field, but more importantly, it's a place where the two bonded. Omar, without having this, I don't think I'd be where I am today. Uh, we've spent numerous hours out here, me and my dad, um, through the good and bad, uh, but mostly good. But uh, it's been it's been awesome. You know, I can't thank him enough for building it because uh, I can't even. I don't even know how many balls we hit, but it's been probably like millions, I swear. I'm not taking the net down, um, and I, I hope, you know, maybe Walker will want to come back sometime. Maybe, you know, I can feed him some balls in here in the future, and, you know, kids um, that look up to Walker, maybe they'll want to come take a swing with him or something like that. Walker's dad, Daryl, built the barn four years before their house was built. He knew when Walker was three that baseball was in his blood. I think it was 2007, it was during the Rockies run, and he was watching Troy Tulowitzki and he wanted a bat. And it was bat and ground balls in the backyard, and I loved it. I, I couldn't change clothes when I got home. He was like, Dad, hurry up, we got, it's getting dark, and that was just what we did. And I, it just resonated with me that I wanted a place where my kids could come. It could be zero degrees or 100 degrees you could come in and you could play. It's been time and money well spent. Yeah. Walker is widely regarded as one of the best position prospects the state of Colorado has ever produced. He hit 20 home runs this spring, the most not only in Colorado, but the entire country. And he fell only one game short of tying the national record for consecutive games with a homer. When I lost that hit home run streak of nine consecutive games, um, I honestly didn't know it was like a national thing and I saw it all over max preps and like all that stuff So had no idea about it really wasn't thinking about I was just doing what I do, you know, just going out and just trying to hit the ball hard Walker's ability to hit the ball hard is what caught the scouts attention last summer in San Diego at a national showcase Martin had more hits above hundred miles per hour than any other prospect He instantly went from off the radar to squarely on it no one really knew who I was, and that's what I was coming here to, to change that, you know. Honestly, coming into this, the summer, I, I had some goals for myself, um, one of them being to show out at area codes, you know, and uh, being able to put on a performance and compete with the, with the best players in my class, it's, uh, it's, it's what I wanted to do, and I knew I could do it, you know. I believe in myself 100%. Now the teenager who was named after Larry Walker has a decision to make. Take a full-ride scholarship to Arkansas or go pro. While his immediate future is unclear, his long-term goals are crystal. Ten years from now, where do you want to be and what's it going to take for you to get there? I see myself playing in the major leagues. Um, I, tr I truly believe that. And uh, honestly, I I'm going to put everything I got into it, you know. It's been one heck of a ride, so I, I, it's, I can't stop now. And while Walker is off to bigger and better things, he and his dad will always have the bittersweet memories of where it all began. I don't like to think about that too much. Um, I will tell you, um, I was doing some yard work. Walker was, um, he was busy with some commitments and Riley had gone to school and um, I walked out here and I was, it was empty. <laughs> so, uh, it's gonna happen, um, but this is the, it's been great. It's just been great. Well, big congratulations to Walker Martin and his family on getting drafted to the Giants. And hey, one day we're going to see plenty of them, of course, with the Giants being in the same division as the Rockies.